Fatou, yeah, Fatou. Ei, Fatou, yeah. How you doing today? We're done with our film, we had fun, we made a space movie, yeah. and you can see my plastic movie that I made with my little plastic figures. Pardon me? What did you just say right now? I thought you said the effort. Uh, you didn't? No. Okay. Well, there's going to be a lot of sound, but the picture's not. Get it? Shoot. Well, here's a little game preview, and now we're gonna see. See, it received that. It doesn't receive it when you write your name. See, this is supposed to be gray, but it's not gray. Oh, maybe I have it now. Shoot. Let's try another game. But you get the basic idea. Okay, see, I figured it out. See, it'll work now. Get far away. C T I N N Y Z. Uh, I like doing that. Baby. Oh. It didn't end. Let's see, pick the little kind. See, now I'm in my practice stage. Well, I didn't qualify up here. I have to have a thousand. I fail. So yeah. Increase your level. So I'll increase my level, all right? So you'll see. This is cool. A car chase. See, I blew off the tire of that mother. You took a couple shots at me. Not receiving very good. Shoot, I'm dead. I haven't been adorned. Shoot, I made it real close. I could have could have died. See, look at that. I didn't qualify. Give me some breaks. Okay, okay. I will. Well, it's time for I'm going to try Action Fighter next, after this game, when I die. Shoot, I have to get that. 
Okay, I have a feeling that I'm gonna die soon. Dude, Dang! Well, I'm dead. At least you got a preview. Oh look at it. The, the picture cleared up when you started record. Look. Yeah. The, the picture cleared up when you started record. Look. Yeah. What was oh. they gonna say? Wow. Uh. Hi. Hi. I'm covering my big belly because it's pretty swelly. Oh, there you go. See. Hello. Hello. Sound check. Sound check. One two three. One two three. Sound check. One two three. Okay. This segment's only going to be five minutes because I opened up the video with Gangster Town. And this summer I was trying to do Sega Master Summer, so this is pretty much what I put together. I didn't stick to it because I had this whole idea that I'm going to do like Afterburner, Action Fighter. Wonder Boy is going to come up, that's going to be a later video. And then I go by the um, the episodes, and each episode is like episode one, two, three, four, five, and now I'm on episode six, and episode six is so if I go A B C D E F, wait, is it episode seven? Yeah, it is episode seven. So A B C D E F G, G for gangster. Gangster Town. And I, you know what, when we opened the video, we didn't do any click sound or anything to sync it up. I went. Oh, you did? You did click it? Yeah. Whatever. Anyways, I have two cameras. I have a camera over here, I have a camera right in front of me, and I'm also using my iPhone to keep time because I don't want to talk more than maybe five, six minutes. So for the, the uh, content that I'm creating for the content of this individual video was Gangster, the video game that I featured from the Sega Master System was uh, Gangster Town. So I was thinking about how in the 1980s, I grew up in the 80s and then the 90s, kind of half the 90s. And in 1988 was when I did this video about Sega Master System. The Sega Master System came with a gun, like the Nintendo Entertainment System had one of those light guns and you could shoot the screen and there was the uh, interaction or the, the experience of the little gun shooting. I might have even seen Sega Master System stuff at the swap, not swap me, sorry, at the thrift store. I just mentioned it because it's been a good prop to play with right now, but that's even besides the point. So, to stay on point, which I'm having a difficulty thing doing because I didn't make any notes today. But when I go, when I get to thinking about gangs. In the late 80s and early 90s, it was kind of trendy to be gang affiliated. I think during the late 80s, a movie came out called Colors. It might have been 88, actually. That would be a fun fact. Hey, Devin, do you know how to put the, like, um, but on the subject of gangs, I'm not going to mention any call letters because I know the call letters for the gangs that were in the areas where I was growing up. There was actually a, they call it, you know it's funny. <laughs> I'm going to use some call letters and maybe if you know what I'm talking about. There was a, they call it a non-racial skinhead gang called Pegan, Pegan Clan when I was in high school. Actually, the more I think about it, it's not a non-racial uh, skinhead gang because, okay, check this out. Pegan stands for P 
punks against G, I won't say what, G and M. So, <laughs> you can only imagine punks against G and M. So, use your imagination. What does a G stand for? Go. No. G stands for, uh, it's, a, uh, it's a slur against Asians. And M stands for a slur against African-Americans. So, that's as much as I'm going to elaborate on that one. If she wants to be a magpie letter, she already has been in half of my videos. Jeez. Oh, I know why she said go. Duh, she wants to leave. <laughs> All right. I'm going a lot longer than I expected, but the other part of this whole um, video is the idea of testing my Canon camera. I got two Canons. I got the EOS over here. I got the XL1 that I got from the thrift store. It's a 1997 camera and actually it does look pretty good and I think my nephew properly set everything up. I don't know, we've been communicating. And as a matter of fact, Devin! Devin! We didn't do white balance. You gotta do white balance. Anyways, it doesn't matter. I probably totally went off a limb, but anyways, I mentioned Pagan Clan just because I was confused. We didn't do white balance. Oh. But I there was something important. I don't even know how to do white balance. So that's when you hold a, a, a blank sheet of paper. A white paper. In f a white paper in front of the camera and set up the little sensors inside of the camera to read the white of the room. Because we got like lighting over here or whatever. I'm just talking more about behind the scenes. And to get back on the point is the whole thing about the gangs I grew up with and how it was trained to be affiliated with the gang. I know the colors, I mentioned them already to these gangs, Whittier, Norwalk, Santa Fe Springs, I think even some Orange County gangs, whatever. Nowadays, it's 2023 being gang affiliated. I don't even know if that's a thing anymore. If it's a thing, let me know. The idea of gangster town was really if you think about the gangs of the 1920s and you know before that here and there whatever gangsters did have a uniform just like the gangsters in the late 80s and early 90s they had a uniform the big old long white socks up to their knees the shorts that were cut off below the knee or I don't even know no they're not cut off shorts they were just like Dicky shorts. They were pretty long. And whatever. Huh? They were pretty long. They, the, the shorts? Yeah. Yeah, like long shorts, yeah. I guess people still probably dress up like that. My nephew just mentioned it, and he's, he didn't grow up in the 90s. He barely grew up at all, but yeah, we're not <laughs> talking about that right now. But uh, I, w I was long-winded, and the whole message I wanted to get across with this whole gangster stuff was just how it was a trend late 80s, early 90s, there was a lot of gang movies that came out in the 80s I could think of, early 90s there was gang movies, it was just a thing. Nowadays I don't even know what it is, so. Try to rebuild all that stuff. We took it out originally.
hills of Santa Monica Hills. Hey, Vato, yeah, Vato. Hey, Vato, yeah, what you want? What you want? What you want?